The money's been spent and there's no going back now. I am kind of mad at myself, but at the same time, I'm overjoyed. If you guys are new here, then by the way, I've been doing a little bit of a room makeover recently, which is why if you see my previous videos, my walls were turquoise. But I just recently painted them white and obsessed is an understatement. When the walls are white, the lighting is just 10 times more better and everything is just... But a few weeks ago, I spent a huge pretty 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 penny on home decor to make my room that Pinterest aesthetic that I wanted for so long. When I tell you I wanted new room decor and a change my room for like the time we moved in to now, which has been like five years, like I'm not joking. I got all my packages here and they are in a box because Miss Girl is a little bit curious and she cannot have an, an open package for too long. Since I filmed that online shot with me, I've obtained a little bit more stuff than necessary and I'm just so excited to show you guys because I got so much stuff. I will definitely have my Amazon storefront. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm saying this, but yes, I have been qualified and I've been accepted into the Amazon Associates program where I can now have a storefront and you guys can shop all my products that I love and I know you guys will too. So first let me go through some of the new things. The first one is this one. In its original packaging we have this like I'll show you a picture of what I'm thinking of, like here. A picture collage? Like, you know the one in Kenna Marie's room? If you guys don't know who she is, she's a YouTuber that I look up to. Right up there with Miss Fernanda Ramirez. Along with that one, I also got this one. This one's actually gifted to me from my mom as kind of like a room welcoming gift, even though she did help me paint my whole entire room. She is one of those people that just said no me. When I say me and my mom are so close, like I'm not joking, I swear, but like, like during school, like, you should start texting me about everything you're doing just to keep me updated. Like that's how like close we guys. Today she said we landed, we went to McDonald's, there was like fish, I sent her all this stuff. She said she went to like a fish market, she's driving to the hotel. But yeah, I just love staying updated with my parents. If you guys aren't close to your parents or haven't talked to them in a while, this is your sign to go tell them, tell them that you love them, tell them that you appreciate them, and tell them thank you for raising you and all that because you guys probably make your parents really really proud and I'm proud of you for that. I'm so proud of you. Now back to frames. I got this one and I already unboxed it. It's this really really orangey vintage vibes but at the same time it goes well with the walls and it matches my new mirror. I'll tell you guys I got a new mirror. I'm gonna show you guys that in a room tour so guys make sure you guys are subscribed otherwise you guys will miss my room tour and you guys just don't want to miss this okay. And I also got two other frames and this one I got is this this one. This one is a little bit more plain Jane. I feel like with picture frames, you definitely need some plain Jane ones. And the last frame I got, this one is from my mom. How cute is this one? It's like heart shaped and it has a gold rim, which matches literally everything in my room. This is another frame that I got. Kind of weird. It's really, really small so you guys can see, but the size of my palm. And again, we're having that vintage vibe. This one is highly different than the other one I got. It's definitely the color I was looking for. It's like this gold color, which really complements my walls. I also got some pictures printed. But again, my frames are really, really small because instead of having one really big picture, I wanted multiple small ones. I actually splurged. I didn't print them on paper. I printed them on canvas. It's supposed to be more durable, waterproof, like all that good stuff. So the first print I got is this one. Um, I'll do a more close up later, but basically, it's just this ditzy floral one. I know it's kind of boring, but trust me, it's just gonna look so good. Then another print I got is this one. I don't know why I got a deer. Like, thinking back, like, I was just browsing on Pinterest. If you guys see my Pinterest board, it's called Roomy, and then when you go in, 
there's a special subcategory called pretty prints. Basically, this deer is just calling my name. So I got it printed. And I have two more. This one is Food Market. It's really cute. I've seen this print all over Pinterest. Like so much people have this print. So I had to hop on the train, guys. And I also got new sheets, by the way. I got new pink sheets. But they're in the wash right now because I'm just too excited and I can't wait to put them on. Um, the last one I got is this one. It's just this flower market one. It's kind of fun, kind of different. Now, let's talk candles. This one is um, stunning. It's just this pink heart that I love and it kind of has like a strawberry scent. Not like that overly powerful like strawberry scent that you get from like candy. This one has like a tartness in it. I can't stop smelling with this one guys. And it kind of also has like that soapy smell. And then I also got this one. It says save the date on it and it's a seashell. This one I'm not the biggest fan of. And then I got two more candles. This one has been trending. We've seen it multiple times on Pinterest. I was debating whether to get the white or the pink. Another candle I got is the exact same bubble one, but a miniature one. Same smell as this one, so I guess they use the same mix, but just put in a different mold. And then the last candle is my favorite. If you guys don't know here, I saved the best for last. So this is my last candle. It's a sea salt lamp candle, and I just have this little tea lamp in here. Yeah, when I light it and show you guys, it's just so pretty. Now let's talk all about plants. I don't like real plants because I have to take care of them. So this is why I buy fake plants. So I have a few fake plants with you guys. This one is the fakest of them all. If you guys don't know and you guys haven't seen like the IV kind of trend where like you have shelves and this is just raining down the shelf. Obviously it looks way more fake. It kind of gives dollar store vibes. And the next plant I got is a bouquet of fake flowers. So I actually got two different bouquets where I put in this little vase. I believe it's a maple syrup jar actually. And I got two bouquets of fake flowers. This is the first one. This one looks more realistic and it's just this pink. I don't even know what the name of the real flower is, but I know they kind of look like roses. The second ones don't look as nice and they, I actually got a set of these. They are just tulips. Moving on, I got this one back here the other day. If you guys know, I actually had one of these the exact same set from before, but I lost a few of them. This one of them. Then, one of my favorite purchases, the Sunset Lab. This is really cute and it comes with a remote control, but I just need the batteries for it. I don't really know how this works. It glows in so much different colors and I'm just so surprised by how far it shoots. Like I thought it was really a really constant circle. And then now I got a lot of lip gloss. It's there for decor. I couldn't spend 50 something dollars on lip oil, so I bought these dupes off Amazon. And guys, when I tell you these are the Dior lip oil dupes, so they smell like Dior lip oils. I know because the amount of times I went Sephora and tested them out and just wanted to buy them is over 50 times. And the only thing that I'm missing is like that lip bulb thingy on top, the Dior logo. But obviously, Amazon can't do that or else I get sued. I got them in three colors. I got this one, which I think is like blossom or something. This one's cherry and this one's like rose. And they're just great for decor, honestly. The packaging is absolutely stunning. On the tray of where I store my lip oils, I have this one. This is like a gold tray and originally it was supposed to be for jewelry but as you guys know i already have like a jewelry stand i have like jewelry organizers and everything so i really didn't need this for jewelry and i've just seen so much about pinterest doing that and the next thing for me is probably getting a skincare organizer the last thing and as you guys know you guys should always save the last part because i always save the best for last cute or not cute it's double-sided so we love that if you guys want to use it this way you guys can use it this way so this mirror hits all of my dreams you guys also have pink one and i've seen the pink one a lot but then i thought about all my pink candles my pink lamp my pink literally everything else so i decided to get something a different little bit different but yeah i love this one so guys thank you so much for watching this haul once again i have everything linked down below i just really hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as you enjoyed filming it the amount of times i was just beaming with happiness when filming this video is awesome over 50. And i'll see you guys